Every day it seems we report on another home break in and burglary and it's happening in neighborhoods all across Los Angeles. And for more on the surge in the break ins and what if anything homeowners can do to protect themselves, we go to eyewitness news reporter Carlos Granda. The rise in residential burglaries has hit areas from Encino to the west side. Yesterday, police arresting a residential burglary suspect in Cheviot Hills. At least two people were inside the home during the break-in. Police say the suspect previously had been arrested 11 times for burglary. The detectives are trying to put uh, other pieces and evidence together to determine whether or not they are connected to any other crime in our area. The LAPD issued a community alert on Monday in response to this rash of burglaries targeting single family homes. In this last case, the house was being remodeled and the thieves got in, breaking into the lockbox that held a key. That was there for the construction crews to use to come in and out uh, during construction. Uh, the investigation determined that the lockbox was missing, uh, but the key was recovered inside the residence. So a lockbox, obviously, uh, today, I would not classify it as a safe uh, uh, way to, especially to, for, to secure a house. Security expert Aria Kozak specializes in real-time crime prevention. He says even houses that have security systems and cameras could be compromised. Those systems are very susceptible to jamming, and it's a serious breach of security. At the minimum, at the minimum, when you have the cameras high, hardwired, uh, you there is a much more greater benefit. District Attorney George Gascon says with such a large county and many different law enforcement agencies, it hopes to gather all the data for investigators. We will sort it out. We will give it to the agency investigating the case. But at the same time, we can start looking and connecting dots and see if that behavior is occurring in another part of the county. The DA's office says it consistently files charges on about 72% of all residential burglary cases. In downtown Los Angeles, I'm Carlos Granda, ABC7 Eyewitness News.